Welcome back. Happening today, the University of Connecticut will have a new president. The Board of Trustees is expected to decide who it will be later on today. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Carolina Cruz is live from UConn and stores where a vote is expected to take place on the next head of that university. Good morning. Good morning. Well, even though Susan Herbst is stepping down as the president here at UConn, she's already left a mark on campus when she became the first woman appointed to serve as president. After serving for nearly eight years, the president at UConn, Susan Herbst, will step down in July. She became the first woman to hold the leadership position when she took over in 2011. A 44-member search committee was created last year when she announced she would step down. The committee decided on a top nominee to take over as UConn's 16th president. The Board of Trustees will hold that final vote today. They are expected to vote in top nominee Thomas Katsalaeus. He's currently the provost and executive vice president of the University of Virginia. We're told Herps will step down this summer, but will stay on as a faculty member. Governor Ned Lamont will be here today ahead of that vote and he will be meeting with the Board of Trustees. We're going to have all of the details on today's key vote on air and on our Channel 3 app. For now reporting in stores, I'm Carolina Cruz, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.